Hi, ladies. I hope everyone had a beautiful, festive Thanksgiving holiday. Today, I'm doing a simple but beautiful candy cane design inspired by Julie 713. It's perfect for the Christmas holiday season. The materials I'm using for this design is a bright neon orange, a dark red glitter polish, and a white striper polish. The orange is called Orange Punch by Orly, and the red is called Ruby Pumps by China Glaze. We're starting with our Hard as Wraps face coat, and then we're going to put on a coat of a neon orange, and um, we're doing that because we want to brighten up our um, red polish that we're using. And then once your orange, neon orange dries, then you're going to put on one coat of the ruby pumps. One coat, not two. So make, make sure you get even coverage. Okay, as you can see, this gives you a bright red um, that you wouldn't have had if you just used um, two coats of the ruby pumps. So that's our background color for our candy cane. And we'll let that dry and then we'll come back and do our candy cane stripes. Okay, our red polish is dry. Uh, now we're going to move on to our um, candy cane stripes. I just wanted to say though, the reason we're using the orange, the um, neon orange, is because I didn't have a bright red um, that I wanted to do with this design. So if you have a bright red, um, you can use a bright red uh, instead of the two-step process. Okay, so now we're going to move on to our white stripes, and we're using our white striper brush, and I'm going to create... I want a big red stripe in the middle of my nail. So I want to do a right stripe. On either side of it. So I'm going to do a white stripe here. right stripe on that side okay and then I'm going to do a large right stripe on the other side I'm going to fill that out. And then I'm going to put thinner stripes on either side. Now for the thin stripes, you want to keep your brush almost completely clean. There we go. A thin stripe. And maybe another thin stripe. Okay. Let's do the same thin stripe on the other side.
There we go. Don't worry about the cuticles. We'll clean that up later. As you can see on this nail, I added some very thin stripes next to my large white stripes. And here's how you do that stripe. You take your white striper polish, shake it up so you can get rid of any um, polish that's accumulated around the neck. Then you're going to clean off the brush, almost all of the polish off the brush. So you have very little polish on the brush. So the brush is very clean. Like that. The brush is very clean. Even cleaner. Okay. And most especially you want a very fine pointed tip. And then you're just going to barely touch down the tip uh, and glide it across. Now you might, you probably won't be able to do this in one stroke because you want to keep it thin. So it's going to take you probably three strokes to get across all the way across the nail. But just put it down. It should be very thin. And that's how you, you don't, you don't want to put any pressure at all. You just want to lightly touch down the tip and slightly, lightly bring it across. You don't want to put any pressure on the tip at all and just do it in about three strokes making a straight line. And you can do it with practice. Okay, and that's our design. Let's review how to do the design. The first thing you want to do is create a center red stripe. So in order to create a central red stripe, what you're going to do is make two right stripes, two thick white stripes on either side of center. That's where you're starting. Then you're going to add some finer stripes on either side. And then finally, you're going to add a ultra fine stripe close to your thick white lines. And that's the design. Notice that the white stripes are long and elongated. And that's how you get this perfect candy cane design. I hope that's clear and I hope you try it. It's real simple for those of you girls who don't like a lot of bling. Uh, it's simple, cute, and festive. Hope you enjoy it. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Bye.